What is up everyone, it's CMG here. So as you can see, I'm in the Overwatch 2 shop. Now, you'll notice something quite unusual and something that I sure as hell wasn't expecting to see in the shop. Now, right here, th this is the Gentle Monster Diva Skin Bundle. Uh, now, if you didn't know, Gentle Monster is actually uh, a Korean, South Korean sunglasses and optical glasses brand. Uh, that has done some kind of deal with Overwatch 2 in not only promoting uh, a pair of sunglasses that I guess they've just released and they just want to get it out there, but also they've put along with it a D.Va skin. And of course it's D.Va because she's from South Korea, right? It would make sense. Uh, now, this is all well and good, but actually when you look at the skin, you'll notice something straight away. This is actually a recolor from the EDM skin that we got from the Season 1 Battle Pass. Yeah, so it's not exactly a completely unique skin for the game, it's just a complete recolor. Uh, so, yeah, as you can see there's some, there's some words there, there's some gentle... Where's the word monster? I don't see the word monster anywhere. I guess it's just the word gentle, right? I'm sure there'll be some kind of word monster somewhere. But anyway, yeah, this is a this is a, a, a recolor uh, from a previous skin. I'll just show you real quickly the one I'm talking about. If I go to Diva, uh, I go to Skins. Oh, right there you go. That's the skin I'm talking about. So this is the skin that has been recolored, and of course this is the better looking skin. Um, so I won't be buying the latter because <laughs> I, I like this skin. Of course, this is one of my favorite Diva skins. So yeah. Anyway, going back to the shop and looking at this skin. Uh, so, yeah, I'm not buying this. For three reasons. And I, I believe I said this on Twitter uh, very briefly. Because uh, I, I looked at it uh, last night. So, the first thing I said was the fact that it looks like the EDM skin. The second reason is the colour of it, which is pink. Now, the D.Va classic skin from Overwatch 1 is also pink. So it leads me to believe that the design of this is, well, it's kind of similar to the classic skin, so there wouldn't be any reason for you to purchase it, really, right? I don't know. Okay, yeah, sure, it's a completely different design to that classic skin, but it's like, you look at it and think, well, if I want a pink diva skin, I just go and use the classic diva skin, right? I, I guess. I mean, if you're if if you if you're somebody that really likes pink, then yeah, I'm sure you'd really get a lot of good enjoyment out of it. And of course, the third reason is probably the most hard hitting one of all is that I'm not stupid enough to give Blizzard more money, because look at the price of this. It's two thousand six hundred. So you're you're literally giving this skin away for for two thousand six hundred Overwatch coins. And it's a recolor. Yeah, mm, that's a... I'm not sure if the Overwatch community is going to take this positively. But yeah, we'll just have a look at what else is in this bundle. So you get, obviously you get the skin, of course. Um, let's have a look at the, the, the Bunny Blaster, I guess. That's what the Bunny Blaster looks like. It's a pink one, I guess. Of course, like I said before, like if you're somebody that's a big fan of pink, uh, if most of you, you're, you'll probably be a girl. Um then yeah, I'm sure you'll be really looking forward to getting the skin. Yeah, if, if, if you like the skin, then yeah, sure, go and get it. It's, uh, it's your money at the end of the day, it's not mine, so... <laughs> Every, or everybody has to be very careful with their money, by the way. Uh, especially when you're playing a game like this. Uh, but anyway, let's have a look at the highlight intro. So there's a highlight intro here. Oh, that's alright, that's, uh, that's pretty neat. That's pretty nice. I do like that. Uh, we've also got a weapon charm here, so... Oh, okay, that's just a mini mini diva. In sort of like an anime kind of form. That's uh, pretty nice. So it's basically like a, a diva weapon charm. And then uh, there's also a name card here. Ah, uh, it's... Actually, I think that's kind of mid, that name card. I'm not really too sure about that one, to be honest. And of course, you've got the player icon here, which is... Oh, that's... that's cool. It's different. 
So yeah, this is basically here because uh, the South Korean sunglasses company, Gentle Monster, have decided to go and do a little partnership with Overwatch 2 uh, to not only promote their sunglasses, or I guess I guess this this style of sunglasses here is kind of like a like a new brand in their company. Uh, yeah, but also of course uh, they're promoting uh, this skin, which I believe will not only go to Overwatch because, of course, they're, you know, making money off for these skins, uh, but also it'll go to the company involved because, of course, it's uh, their sunglasses that they're promoting. Of course, they're going to make money from this as well. So, yeah, I mean, that's the reason why this uh, skin's here. So it's, it's just a disappointment that it's just a recolor and nothing completely unique. Uh, it's just taken from the EDM skin from the... Uh, the season one battle pass. So, yeah. But yeah, I'm, I'm not getting the skin. I, I don't have a reason to buy it. I, I've already got the latter skin, so I, I don't really need to get this. Um, I'm quite happy with the uh, the one that I have currently. So uh, yeah. But yeah, it, it, this is available. Uh, there's, I think there's some other skins uh, as well uh, for um, Ilari as well. Um, but I think we all knew about the Ilari skins before. Uh, then you've got the Complete Hero Collection. Yeah, it's... You, what you're going to do, what you're going to notice is you're going to see quite a lot of these um, partnership things with uh, with uh, Overwatch 2. A little bit like um, the the anime one. What's it called? The One Punch Man anime collaboration with all of those um, skins for Kiriko, Doomfist, uh, Genji, and Soldier 76. But you're going to see these kind of skins pop up where there's going to be some partnership deals with certain companies and they want to promote something. Um, but yeah. I would I would have liked to have seen something a bit more unique rather than just take a skin that they've already got and then recolor it. But yeah. I guess this is in the game now. So uh, yeah, let me know in the comment section down below if you're going to buy this skin. And uh, let me know what you think. Do you think this is kind of lazy from Blizzard because this is a recolor? Or actually, do you think you're somebody that really likes pink and you're definitely going to get this skin regardless? Uh, anyway, thank you very much for watching the video, guys. If you like this idea for content and you want to see more in the future, go ahead and click on the subscribe button. Send a comment, like the video, and then turn on your notifications. It really does help me out a great deal. You can also check me out on all of my other social medias, my Twitter account, my Discord, and of course, my TikTok. And don't forget as well, my threads and my Instagram. Thank you for watching the video, guys. Have a great day. Have a great life. Be nice to your fellow gamers because we're all human beings. I've been CMG as always, and until the next video, I shall see you later. Peace.